that I'm in my car again surprise surprise so today is Matt's work Christmas party and we have been running around like madmen this morning trying to get stuff together things ready for the party we are not prepared at all we need to get food I need to make so many snacks we have to go to the grocery store to get a bunch of stuff we have to clean the house um, there's so many other things that we need to do and I can't even think of them this is the time when my anxiety sucks because on the one hand, I'm so excited about this party. I'm so excited about Christmas and everything coming up. On the other hand, I'm freaking out because I can't stop making lists in my head of everything that I need to do and everything that needs to be done and things that are not done and just all of these tiny little things that just add up and... I constantly have this list of things in my head that I'm anxious about and I'm anxious about the party and I'm anxious about the people coming over and just anxious because I'm anxious and I don't want to be anxious for the party and I'm just being honest with you guys like I said I'm so excited about the party you guys know me I love Christmas and I love people and I, I just love getting together and having fun but I've also got these weird stupid worries that I'm trying to deal with. So I'm going to go work out right now. And then after we get back, I get back to Matt's office. Hopefully we can leave. Then we're going to go to the grocery store and then we have to pick up a white elephant gift for the party. I need to figure out some kind of party game for everybody to do so it can be fun. And then we go home and then we clean and then I, I'm going to stop making lists. I'm going to go work out. I'm going to take it one task at a time. So right now my only focus is to work out. To focus. I have to pee and then I have to work out. So that's the only thing I'm going to focus on right now. If any of you guys have anxiety, it really helps me because you constantly have these lists in your head. Just check things off one at a time and focus on one task at a time. Even if it's like getting a glass of water, whatever it is. And then Knowing that I checked something off of that task helps immensely because it's just one thing that I can say that I got done, even if it's insignificant. Like I said, getting a glass of water, something as simple as that, it can make a difference. So I'm going to go get this thing done and then I don't know what else I'll show you guys. I have my phone with me because I forgot my camera at his office. So I'll have my camera for the rest of the day. Here goes the fun. Welcome to Vlogmas get this day started. Oh, Christmas party! Oh, Christmas party! Are you ready? No. No, we're not ready at all. So I got my workout done. Told you guys I was gonna do that, and I did that. So it's now noon. We got a lot to do. Yeah. I, do. I got my list in here. I have a free drink at Starbucks. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great! So amazing. Well, shit. Whoa, oh, now. Shit. Watch out now. Shit. Oh, we had to make a stop because. Shit! Look at the friggin' line. So I got a uh, veggie bowl with all of this stuff in the guac, and then he got that. And then a drink and chips. So we're gonna eat this like as fast as possible and then go to HEB. Alright, so we're back from the store, and these are just a few of the um, things that we got at the store. Just some of the party snacks we're gonna have. We're not doing like a big meal, just some finger food stuff, um, hot chocolate, and dip, and I'm gonna make some little. Um, sausage, croissant, dog thingies, and chips, of course. And then I'm also going to be making these cookie brownies. I'm going to make some chocolate covered date balls. Um, what else am I making? I'm also making a nacho dip to go with the chips. I'm going to make um, a spicy cheese ball if I have time. And I've got some fruit in the fridge. So yeah, I have to get started. It's three o'clock. The party's at like six. So I need to get going right now. All right, so we got our spread out. Um, All of the snacks. I'll start over here. Oh, forgot, almost forgot. These are um, little date, chocolate covered date and Biscoff 
truffles that I put together. Uh, candy canes. We got some off-brand Oreos. Caramel, cinnamon corn, some little peanuts. These are cookie brownies with uh, melted chocolate drizzled over. Of course, we got some healthy options for you. Fruit chips with a nacho dip that's so good. I need to warm it up. Little um, hot dog filled croissants. Chips, more chips, chips, hummuses, some cream cheese dip, veggies for the dip, and Matt. Are you excited? I think so. I always hate this moment of like when everyone's showing up. Like, oh, are they showing up? Probably not. I'm just gonna go home. Oh, wait, okay. wait, we are home. Um, and we were gonna take a, uh, a shot, because we did last year. Um, our little pre-game shot, but I'm just gonna have some. <laughs> I'm just gonna have some coffee. Um, this is my outfit, by the way. Socks, Santa Claus, and Merry Christmas to fill the animals. Got my little earrings, got my little headband, everything. So pretty much all of the Christmas. And then we have a really fun game planned for the party that I hope everybody enjoys. Um, so. Stay tuned for that. I'm gonna be eating some snacks. Probably not gonna track my macros. We're gonna have fun. So, see you guys at the party. Hope y'all are ready. This is my drink of choice for the night. Yeah. My alcohol. Hey, this is a good time. Um, I had a question for us. Yeah. Favorite show and favorite book. Favorite show is Mad Men. I just like it. It's good. And uh, favorite book? Come back to me on that one. Okay. Favorite show for me? There's three. I have three. It's between three. The Office, Mad Men, and Breaking Bad. Three favorite shows. Favorite book? Yeah. The book, Redeeming Love, changed my life. And I'll never forget like just the feeling of reading it and realizing what love is. I highly recommend Redeeming Love by Francine Rivers. It's an amazing, amazing book. Book, go. Go author. I don't really have a book. Chuck Palahniuk. Chuck Palahniuk. Yeah. You don't have a favorite book? I do, book. but I just can't think of it. I haven't, I haven't read a book in like two, three years. I haven't read a fun book in that long. They've been all like business books. Such business books. Business. Boring. Yeah, yeah I'm just I'm just staring at that screen up there. Yeah. Gross. Um, okay, I guess that counts as favorite book. And they get to try. That's not me first. Yeah. Whoever unwraps them. So they just keep going until they get done. And whoever so unwraps them. Oh my god. Oh, that is personal. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know you're next, right? Why are you filming? When you say doubles, both of them. Yeah, both have to be the same. Come on, Amanda. What? What's taking you so long? <laughs> I've never played this before. This is impossible. <laughs> <laughs> you're like this. You're like this. You're like this. You're like this. <laughs> it's gonna be like, alright, it was glass. <laughs> Come on. There's no wrapping paper on it, it's just a painted box. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. Double sixes. Oh, Chelsea, come on. Oh, dang. Yeah, come on, keep going. Santi, hurry. Oh, man. Walk over there. 
so you can't. Oh, can't waste time. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, so. How'd it go, Matt? Pretty good. We still have chips left. Look at all the chips. Matt, did you have a few drinks? Yes, yes I did, yeah. yeah. But we, we also got a VR. Come we did. On. We watched you play it earlier. Um, there's some scary games on there. Yeah, we, we didn't watch you play it earlier. <laughs> no, you I'm screamed. glad you didn't. Everything is cleaned up. So we ended up with the VR headset and this sweet backpack. Which is what we bought. We bought I, I bought it. That was my I, gift. I picked it out. And then, oh, it has crackers. Ritz crackers will basically like, and sour paste kids. Sour paste kids in it. Um, side note, I ate like all of the cookie brownie thing. A lot of chips. Oh, is that what it is? Today was not a good nutrition day for me, but that's okay. My belly's full. I'm probably gonna feel like duty tomorrow. It is what it is. A decent turnout for the party. It was, it was last year. I think everybody had fun. Oh, that one game was fun. Oh my gosh, the, so the oven mitt, oven mitt yeah. wrapping game. Um, you guys saw like a second of that. Basically what you do is you try and unwrap a gift with oven mitts, but I wrapped it like so well. It took forever, but it was fun. It was, oh my gosh, these are good. Highly recommend trying that game if you can for the Christmas season. What are you doing tomorrow? Oh, just sweater. Ugly good. sweater Christmas party tomorrow. Focus is on this thingy. No? Maybe not. Bridal shower and climbing Sunday. I got some, uh, I got some weight to lift this weekend. I should have some extra energy from all the food I ate today. Cheeks are all puffy from sodium. We're gonna get ready for bed. It's gonna conclude today's vlog. I appreciate you guys watching every day. Thank you. Um, side note, I'm like 99% sure that the unsubscribing issue that I've had with my channel is a part of some weird YouTube thing that's going on. More and more channels are talking about it lately and a bunch of them are losing hundreds to thousands of subscribers per upload. Uh, mine's like maybe two or three subscribers per upload, which is a good amount for my little channel. So yeah, strange. Just a side note for you guys, if you do want to stay subscribed to the channel, make sure and check back like every few days or so because it is unsubscribing people randomly. So there's also a little notification button Right next to my name, underneath the videos where it shows my channel, there's a little bell that you can click on and that'll notify you whenever I upload new videos. But I think it also keeps you subscribed to the channel so you don't get unsubscribed by whatever bug is going around. Anyway, thank you guys for tuning in. I will see y'all in tomorrow's vlog. Merry Christmas, happy holidays, happy new year, and we'll see you next time.